Seems like a long time, but nothing seems like a long time when I am with you. I feel like I'm walking on water since the day that I asked your father to let go of his daughter. So give me your blessing, sir. I'll give her all that I've got. Doesn't look like much, but it sure feels like a lot. Let her take my heart and take my hand. Take my heart and take my hand. Take my heart and take my hand again and again. Right. Always be my number one. A whole lot more than good enough. Oh. Giving everything I've got to gain every second lost. Six years just ain't enough. With you, I'm happy being me. Don't pretend 'cause I don't need to. I'm a thousand miles from home. Never on my own. When you whispered down the phone, well I guess we never saw this coming. Halfway around the world calling, but I just want you to know that I'd have all I need. You were standing right in front of me.
is my absolute pleasure to be with you here today on this wonderful and special occasion. When I first met you, I immediately knew you were special. But never in my wildest dreams would I have imagined 15 years later I'd be standing before you on our wedding day. I'll never forget the day I finally asked you to be my girlfriend, standing outside of school as you had to rush to catch your bus. I love that you keep me on my toes and always know how to make me laugh. I love that you are always willing to explore together, see new sights, and try new things to keep things fresh. I love that you always push not just yourself, but also me to grow, evolve, and be better. I love that we have learned to grow as individuals while never forgetting each other and our commitment. I love that you are always willing to have open, judgment-free conversation on any topic we discuss and make me feel validated in my feelings. I love that you have the biggest heart, you give me so much love and care, and every time you step into work, you pour your heart and soul into every child that crosses your path. As your husband, I promise you that I will continue to do anything and everything you need me to do. I promise I will continue to mow the lawn, and I promise that I will continue to do the dishes. I promise that you always have my full attention and care. I promise that I will always support you as you chase your dreams. I promise to never hold you back or keep you from doing something that you enjoy, and I promise to always be thankful for our relationship. I promise to wake up and choose you every single day and give you my all. I promise you that as life changes and our family begins to grow and we get busier and busier, I will never let us go to bed angry. I will always make sure to listen to you and acknowledge your feelings. I will always make you feel valued and cared for. I promise that today is not the end of us dating. It's just the beginning. I promise to always look to surprise you, be thoughtful and deliberate in my actions and words to make you feel wanted and understood. I promise you my heart, Taylor that you will forever be the most important person in my life. You have given me so much joy and happiness in 15 years that I cannot wait to experience the rest of our lives together. On November 9th, 2011, I asked you to be my girlfriend, and on October 10th, 2020, I asked you to marry me. On both occasions, you said yes, before I could finish my sentence. So I hope today, as we say I do, you feel that same excitement and confidence to be my wife. Some people may start their vows with, it was love at first sight, or I knew the moment I met you. But that's just not our story. <laughs> we met the first day of fifth grade in Mr. House's class. I must have thought you were kind of special, because I can still tell you what you were wearing to that day. Camo shorts and a white t-shirt. <laughs> Although our story may start there, it was in the years and years to follow that gradually, but undeniably, it became apparent that I couldn't and did not want to live life without you. As we stand here today, after 10 years of memories and so much laughter, I could not be more excited to marry my best friend. Cameron Jacob Griffin, I love the man you are, the man you're becoming, and the man you hope to be. I love your tender nature, your fun spirit, and your blue eyes. I love the way you're always down for an adventure or for a lazy Sunday spent on the couch. And I love your passion, except for sometimes when it's about a soccer match that it's definitely not worth yelling about. <laughs> As we start on this new adventure of marriage, I have a few promises for you. I promise that no matter what, I will always be your number one fan. I promise to always challenge you and support your dreams. I promise to be by your side through the best of times, the worst of times, and everything in between. I promise to show my love daily through my words and through my actions and not to get annoyed when you inevitably ask me to show my love through back rows every night. I promise to not just grow old together, but to continue to grow together. I promise to always listen and never hurt you, to always kiss you and never shame you, to always love and never leave. I promise to always be your partner, lover, and best friend. I look forward to falling in love with you over and over and over again each day for the rest of my life. It is and always will be an absolute and distinct pleasure at this time to now pronounce you husband and wife. Sir, you may kiss your bride. It's a beautiful night.
You've got a friend in me When the road looks rough ahead And you're miles and miles from your nice warm bed You just remember what your old past said Boy, you got a friend in me Yeah, you got a friend in me You got a friend in me. You got a friend in me. You got trouble, and I got 'em too. There isn't anything I wouldn't do for you. We stick together, see it through. 'Cause you got a friend in me. You got a friend in me. Some other folks might be a little bit smarter than I am, big and stronger too. Maybe, but no.